everybody I want to welcome you back to the Ovel Beauty channel I want to say thank you so much for joining me and coming back to watch another video so today what we're gonna talk about is five steps tricks to lose 50 pounds in five months yes just five months so what I did to lose 50 pounds in five months I'm gonna tell you it was definitely a challenge, definitely worth the wild. I'm so happy that I did it. I'm so happy that I actually completed this journey. And I just want to say, listen up, listen to this video, and you'll be able to do it too. So I actually, just a little bit about me. So I actually was pre-diabetic for five years straight in a row. And I was very nervous because my family, we have a history of diabetes. So I wanted to make sure that I wasn't going to get into that kind of same path because I've seen what it has done. And I know that it was just something that I did not want to do. So what I told myself was, I'm going to do this now. And I did. I was able to lose 50 pounds in just five months. So I was very happy and very excited about my results. So I wanted to share them with you. Um, so the first tip is to be consistent and I say to be consistent because you want to make sure that you have a mindset that you're going to see this through, that you're not going to stop by any means necessary. You are going to see it through because you will. But if you put your head to it, put your mind to it, you're going to do it. But you really have to make that commitment and you have to say, you know what? Enough is enough. I'm going to get this done and you'll get it done. I promise you so consistency is tip number one it's a key tip because I told myself at the beginning of this journey that I was not going to stop I actually did it I was able to complete it and I'm very excited about that so I wanted to share this guys with with you because I want you to also be able to really succeed and hit the goal that you want to hit because it's so important. It's so important to make goals and to hit them and succeed because you feel so good afterwards. You're like, all right, good. Now I'm on to the next goal. So I wanted to share this with you. Tip number two is I exercised two days a week for months for the five months that I was doing this for I exercised two days a week I ended up the week sometimes five days a week but I only did it for about 20 minutes a day so I'm lucky enough to where I work I actually have a gym at our office and I was able to do that um, so basically at lunchtime instead of you know going hanging out whatever I just literally went straight to the gym for 20 minutes a day and knocked it out the park I was just like all right you know what now it's done um, sometimes I would go in the morning but most times I would go at lunch so that's something that I would definitely say because you want to be able to get that energy back get that momentum back get that strength back so going to the gym will definitely even if it's for 10 minutes a day 15 minutes a day do something some sort of exercise just so you can get to your goal because that's the ultimate thing that you want to achieve is getting to your goal so definitely do that and you will be able to achieve it in just five months so the next thing that I did which will be tip number three I did intermittent fasting so what intermittent fasting is is a period of time in your day where you are not eating you are just drinking water taking minerals and you are not eating so what I did is I wake up very early in the morning to get to work so what I'll do is at five o'clock in the morning I'm already up and by 5 till 10 30 I'm not eating water I would have about three bottles of water and I would drink that in the morning and I'll take my minerals so I'll make sure that I have bladder rack or I would have um, other um, minerals such as Irish sea moss um, and I also had dandelion root, so I would make a concoction. I would just make a tea out of water in the morning in order to make sure that I was going to be able to stick to the routine and stick to what I needed to do in order to lose this weight. So 
in that period of time I felt my body very hungry and very tired and I was just like what am I doing should I really do this I did a lot of research on it beforehand but I was very nervous because I was like I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this I was I just was doubting myself I had a lot of fear and I was just like am I starving myself is this even good for me what am I really doing but I did a lot of research beforehand so I needed an opportunity to just really cleanse my body and put a lot more back of minerals into my body that I needed versus just food just to eat or food that was just no good for you. So I did that um, for all five months. Um, I did all the, the intermittent fasting. I was consistent with it, did it every day for five months straight. I exercised. Um, twice a week for 20 minutes kicked it up towards the end and start doing it five days a week four days a week um, and I just saw results immediately I saw my energy changed I saw my pace and my walking changed my breathing changed um, I wasn't um, snoring at night anymore which was um, definitely a blessing for my fiance to not have to hear me snoring at night um, so that was definitely good also what I did was I drank only water and that's tip number four only water only only water um, I would have tea and that would be it I wouldn't put any sugar in my tea I might put a lemon in my tea but I didn't drink anything else but water for five months I just told myself I don't want to put anything in my body that was going to create more calories or that was actually going to just be um, just not beneficial for my weight loss and not beneficial for my health. Sugar is was a big deal for me so I was just like that's a deal breaker so I'm not going to do it. So what I did was drink only water bottled water I did not drink tap water I'm not a fan of the tap water um, where I live so I also curbed my alcohol intake I did not drink alcohol at all as well during this five months so that definitely contributed a lot to my success of 50 pounds in five months five months just five months consistency that's all you need and you got it so the next thing that I want to say and this is a big one so I really hope that you guys finish the video to the end because this was the big thing that took everything over the top if you didn't do anything else that I said in the previous um, discussion that I was talking about you can do this and you will still see major results you might not see 50 pounds in five months you might but this is what I did in order to lose those 50 pounds and I'm very happy I'll show you a clip of a a video makeup video a makeup picture actually make a photo that I did where I was able to kind of recreate a picture of me when I was 50 pounds heavier to 50 pounds lighter and I'll definitely put that picture at the end of the video so that you can see it but there was definitely a big change I went back to work and I mean it's not like I was out of work but there was just one month where everyone at work was just like Sasha like what did you do like you look so different and um, I was just like very happy because I wasn't doing it for anybody I was doing it for myself this because it was so important to me and I want to see if I can help anyone else in their journey I definitely want to do that so without further ado what I want to say was my biggest biggest help in helping me lose 50 pounds in just five months was becoming vegan <laughs> so this was a major key in me losing 50 pounds and I actually had to buy a vegan cookbook after um, just like three months because I mean you don't run out of things to eat but you're eating the same things over and over again because you're just like oh like how could I get more creative and when you go out to eat you don't really see a lot of options for vegan food you just see a salad but this was awesome because I was able to pick this up at Barnes and Nobles and just find different ingredients and recipes and things that like I love so much like look how good that looks 
that looks so good so so good and I found my new love for avocados I thought I loved avocados before but I love avocados now even more and it was only $9.98 at Barnes & Nobles when I picked it up um, I also had a coupon for I think it was 20% off so I was able to use that as well on it so that was an awesome pill for me it was the best thing I've ever done for myself um, in another video I'll definitely talk to you more about me going vegan and how that um, helped and impact my life the pros and cons I'll definitely talk more about that but I just wanted to tell you guys going vegan was the best thing for me I'm so happy that I did it it was so important I literally just told myself for this time span I started I was like boom I'm gonna get this done I'm gonna just start this today I was already on a track of being vegetarian um, for about seven months beforehand so I was just like you know what let me just kick it into high gear and just knock it out of the park so I wanted to say that was so amazing to do that I felt my energy increase I felt my um, just my my body just feeling so much better I didn't feel so congested or I actually don't get colds much anymore either and it's winter where I live and everyone in the office is sick around me a lot of times but I haven't really gotten sick so that's another plus in becoming vegan is just like not getting sick as much because you're just pumping your body with all the great minerals that you need and it's almost just like your body helps to fight that a lot faster um, I've noticed that my skin has cleared up so much and um, just like I'm not as sensitive to certain things as I was before and there's just so many benefits in becoming vegan Thank you guys again for watching this video please leave comments below so I know if this video was something that's helpful for you guys or if I should be talking a little bit more about um, you know veganism more about makeup or whatever you guys are looking into a lot of the makeup that I even have on today is vegan and cruelty free which I'm very happy with especially this lipstick color this lipstick is from Dr. Hushka, Huska, but I'll definitely put that in the description bar below. Um, but yeah, so this lipstick is from them and it is vegan and cruelty free, which is pretty amazing. And uh, a lot of, and I have Pacifica eyeshadow wand as well. So a lot of my blush and a lot of my foundation and stuff is from vegan and cruelty free brands. So I definitely want to do more makeup tutorials and makeup videos with brands that are vegan and cruelty free because I want to go more towards that, especially just things that I put on my skin. I want to make sure that it matches what I'm eating inside because that also reflects everything else as well. So I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video to the end and I hope you enjoyed and if you are interested in this shirt that I'm wearing, I want my cocoa. There's definitely a story behind it um, and I'll definitely leave a link in the bio but um, that way you, if you guys want to pick up a shirt like this or if you guys want to pick up any shirts that are that you're interested in I'll definitely leave a link in the bio I'll also leave a link for the person to contact um, Kishan DS, DSTR and you'll be able to contact he can also make custom shirts for you as well if you're interested in a custom shirt he can definitely hook that up for you guys and I just want to say this t-shirt is super soft and it's super comfortable it just fits perfectly this one is a size small that I ordered and I just love it so much. It's just so comfortable and I just want to just, you know, if you guys are interested in any t-shirts or anything like that with like a custom order or just some of the designs that he already has on the site, definitely check it out. And thank you again so much for watching. Bye to all my beauties out there. Just want to say love you and I really hope that I can be a someone that you guys can turn to if you do not have an opportunity to really just know what you're looking for or if you need help or if you just need a, someone to just like kind of hold your hand through the process because it is tough but if you do stay consistent you do watch what you're eating and putting into your body then you will be fine you will succeed you will hit your goal you will do everything that you wanted to do you will be amazing so I just want to say love you again
wish you the best and I really hope to see you again the next time.